You suppose he took a shortcut through the realm between realms? No, the stones have not moved. Baldur's chasm is too unstable, brother. The lad wouldn't try it. <laughs> Let's see. Tracks heading down to the frozen river. That's most likely where he did the burying. <sighs> Locked. Aye. Fire's dwindling now. Where else could he have gone from here? He crawled through here. Even for you. Nightmares? I dream of the past. Almost every night. Ah. The bad old days? In Greece? No. It feels like Faye is trying to tell me something. You don't mean to say you're talking to ghosts again, brother? No. But it is something more than memory. Use your words, brother. The tracks stop here. Lautnerman! And we're not alone. They should not be this close. We should check on the protection, Steve. There's a tree up ahead, yeah? Well? You were right. The stave is broken. Explains our trespassers. What happened here? A bear. Mauled. By what? A larger bear. Wounded. The fight destroyed the tree. We must find Atreus. Aye. Between the savage beasts and marauding raiders, he may have sought shelter. <laughs> Follow the trail. We'll find him. <laughs> Aha! Trail's on the other side of that gap. If you can clear the way. <laughs> Any idea what could have made the lad wander off? We argued. He accuses me of... hiding from Odin. Eh, only sensible to keep a low profile after killing three of his kin. A reckoning will come. That is why Atreus must learn to survive on his own. Oh, this is about that prophecy. Just because the giants had you dead on some wall full of... Otherwise accurate predictions. I do not believe in prophecies. Well, good.
And what do you believe about prophecy, Mumia? I'm skeptical by nature, though we have seen things that defy explanation. So, speaking as the smartest man alive, I've no bloody idea. Ah! In the <laughs> 